I need to clear some memory here. Hey, how are you doing? Good, I saw you filming some uh, flyers. Yeah, what well, do you I'm think? I'm reporting on it. Oh, okay. Um, I'm in support of all of it. I, um, I usually report on uh, the Freedom Protests in okay. Norwich and in London. Okay. Um, cool. Well, I'm Dave. Nice to meet you, Dave. I'm Sydney. Sydney. Yeah, I'll shake your hand. Nice to meet you. Um, do you want to have a look at my flyer? This is about the electromagnetic universe, so yeah. I go a little bit deeper than Flat Earth. Yeah, Flat Earth is like a gateway into that this whole Newtonian science, the atom and all of that, is actually a fabrication. And that everything is electricity and magnetism and play inside of an ether, inside of an, an, an atmosphere environment. And we, like the fish, the fish don't know they're in the sea, we don't actually know we're in the sea. We're in a sea right now and we grow in it, we exchange electricity with it. We get magnetism from the ground, which is why I like to go foot um, and so we I think that we're like if you look into nature we're like a, an apple inside a big apple so if you take that as an electromagnetic apple it's a torus and that is a reciprocating torus so it's kind of going around into itself like an hourglass yeah and it goes up and then comes out your corona your crown comes out and then goes back up again and there's a torus word in in you know in the ladies you know there's a CLI torus did you know that? That's a Taurus word. So they're t telling us that we're actually Taurus systems. And it's all electromagnetic. Um, you are, so if it's all electromagnetic, it means that you can, take se you can take a magnet, two magnets, and put them together and you get one magnetic field. And I suggest to people that we're in a seven-tier magnet system, up to God, whatever God is. And that when you are separate from God, you're your own magnet. When you're part of God, that's just what you're one with all that is. And I think that's what we've meant to achieve, is become one like that. Because if you think of like the Russian dolls, the Matryoshka, there's seven dolls, nested dolls. The small one is you, and the big one is Mother Nature, is God, it's our lies, everything that we see in the world. So that's how I see it. And I think we're meant to be, um, if we understand that, then we love each other. We, we, we know where we come from, we um, treat the world with honor, you know, the mother, this great land with, with, with honor and respect and so on. Um, so I think that's why it's vital for people to know this truth. It also helps for people to realize, wow, all of these other so-called conspiracies are intended to, you know, steal something from me, to weaken me, to soften me, to damage me. Um, so they're all relevant, but for me, you know, Flat Earth opens up the electromagnetic theory and uh, there's plenty of science to kind of back that up. So cool. No, you can have it. Oh, thank you. Oh, it's for you. I didn't know if uh, you wanted to give it up. No, no, I wanted to give it to you. Thank you. Please, and there's a link to my website. It doesn't have a lot of content on it, but no, that's... I wasn't doing it for the camera. I don't do shit for the camera. This is how I am all the time. Yeah, I was around Africa for a year last year and doing it in South Africa, you know, just flyering people, talking, most of it off camera. Outreach. Outreach, homeless, drug users, stuff like that. Uh, and just general citizens. Yeah. I think it's good to raise awareness to be able to be an alternative view. Uh, yeah, for me it goes further than just an alternative viewpoint because it's more about um, a whole new paradigm of thinking. If we're going to go into the age of Aquarius and it's meant to be this awakening, well, you cannot awaken watching BBC. Yeah, exactly. You cannot. You cannot. Let me get this guy up. Hey, bro, we can prove that NASA's faking space. Did you know that? Norwich. Truth Tour 2022. Day something or other. Hello there, hello there. Hello, good morning. Oh, happy rising, I should say. Bye. Ah. Hey there. Time to uh, say hello to Sven. How's it going? Uh, a gentleman come over with his friend and although he was technically right by saying well my statement is only I'm glad that we live in a society where everybody's allowed to express their own opinions someone's on get ahead of me with the chalk yes. is that Dean? Dean good man yeah. good man Dean with the chalk. the chalk can I let you touch my big one 
Actually, oh, and look, I've got that to fill your trousers. Um, I've already got paid down there. Right. <laughs> Tom Jones. Thank you. Oh, a little battery charger in the house. Well, your battery. Oh, charger, we brought that. Little yeah, little yeah, we got that for you. I think Jason's got it. Yeah. Good sleep. Yeah, good sleep. Good night. You all good? Yeah, fantastic. Good. 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 Quite late, but maybe here by half past eleven. Okay. Two hours slap. It's not bad. No. Yeah, two hours from south east. That's not bad. Yeah. Oh, well, well done for coming back up. He needs another round of applause. Looking forward to it. Good. Good. Good, good, good. I've got plenty of cold water if anyone's thirsty, by the way. So I've got planned, I've got a, a lump that's two liters of ice that'll melt during the course of the day. Later on, it'll be less dense, or is it more dense? Will it raise the water levels of the ocean? No, my, 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 well, my bottle will overflow because as it melts, it'll just blow the lid off the, which is, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So we need to build Hello, mate. Are you um, doing this of your own accord or is it like from like yeah. an organization? Yeah, we're all individuals just oh, doing just our own thing. person I have to work <laughs> Sorry. No, no. no. Yeah, we don't work yeah. for anyone. I'm and so tired, man. Like, I have nothing against anybody as an individual. It's just every time I get to Norwich, it's either I get told I'm going to hell by Christians, yeah. I get told I'm set evil for aborting babies, which I don't do. Yeah. And now I'm being told the earth is flat. Um, this is the most beautiful, just, one of the most beautiful truths. You know why? I, no, because it takes not, Jesus out of the equation. Subject, takes religion just, out of the equation. It's just to do with wanting to have a walk. I have severe mental illness. You I have. can't come to town anymore. Okay. There's someone has an idea that they need mm. to put onto mm. me. Mm. Because without everybody else's validation of their mm. ideas, mm. they realize that it means very little. Mm. And that is their ego is bad. <laughs> so I kind of have to put up with it. Well, just, we think that there's a lot of mental health so in the... I'm thinking about some sort of counter protest thing. Where I form a loud rock... I've been in a rock band for like 15 years. Yeah. So you get a drum kit and an amplifier, no one's going to be able to hear anyone. So that's my idea, but I'm working on it. Okay. Because one day well, I just want to be able to walk through here again peacefully. Yeah. But, um, but what if we, a lot of the mental health that people are suffering today is a consequence of us being lied to when we were kids? You know, given religions, be, don't you think religions cause wars? I, and stuff? I believe that you're not lying to me, but I believe that you're not correct. Do you know what I mean? Huh. So therefore, I don't think that we can have any sort of argument or mm. uh, discussion where it doesn't just enforce the other more into their respective echo chambers. So I'm going to push you more into your opinion. You're going to push me more take, into my Take opinion. some information you can read in your own time. I talk about the electromagnetic universe because I think that we are the center, like Jesus is you. So that's what it's I say. It's an interesting subject. Is that you I, or God? I can personally um, sense and mildly control electromagnetic energy. Yeah, yeah. But it does, I don't necessarily believe it then works in. Your, but I understand oh, no, what each of us is an electromagnetic just, Taurus um, system. Yeah. And we live inside a Taurus system. Look at an orange. That's a Taurus. Look at tornadoes. There's all we've got this turning electrical energy. And magnetism is clearly here. You know, the animals yeah. use it for navigation. We can use it for navigation. Yeah. So we're in an electromagnetic system, bro. And I'd say to people, it's like God decided to come down in a tiny form as you and have an experience of itself. Whatever God is, whatever you believe, you know, whatever you yeah. call nature. Mother Nature said, look, I'm going to create this terrarium for me to come and have a, an experience of myself in where I can actually touch and feel. Because in the, in the all, I'm everything. I'm, I can't touch myself. I can't do anything. So in that context, I say that there's seven heavens between you and God. And you are like the Russian doll, the smallest one in the middle. And the biggest one is oh, God. Oh, I have a question. I should be in a wheelchair, uh, but I take a, me I take a medication mm -hmm. weekly. It's a crap medication. It makes me feel horrible. Yeah. So I do know that they create side effects. Yeah. But without it, I would be in a wheelchair. And yeah. if I was in a wheelchair for the last nine years, I would have killed myself. Yeah. So I just don't know what your opinion on that would be. Because I've tried, I did like a five year voyage of trying to fix my illnesses. Okay. To nearly everything you could think of. Yeah. I've been to different yeah. countries, different people spiritually. Um, Everything, yeah. and it came down to methotrexate once a week. Without that, wheelchair. Okay. What's so we 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 live in a world in which we believe that our, our natural God-given uh, essence, when we right. come here, is traumatized. Uh, from birth, actually, the heel prick you the moment you come out of your mother, oh, yeah, yeah, uh, and that heel prick goes right up your sciatic nerve into your groin, and that destabilizes your seat of control, your seat of certainty, because it comes from the the, the lower chakras down in the groin, right? Is this so, just for prote protection? No, no, no. I do it for because I, I, as I, I'm a private individual.
Well, I, I have um, a YouTube channel that follows me, yeah. supports me, gives me a little bit of donation That's to keep cool. doing this work because yeah. they really think that humanity needs to know that we've all been tricked That's into awesome. thinking that we are evolved yeah. apes and that this slavery system that we work in is correct. But check out the electromagnetic universe yeah, stuff okay. because it really, I think, puts you at the center of the wheel rather than on the outside, somewhere okay. dangerous. I just don't think I'm... I don't think I could believe I'm the center of anything. You know? Yeah, because your programming has been designed to minimize us all. Individually, that important. So yeah, again, that's what religion and science does. Yeah, Particularly enough. science, because science will say we're insignificant specks of dust in a you know mac in a macrocosm. And then that's why I used to believe until seven years ago. You know, I was forty seven. Years ago? I had DMT. Aha! Cool. Okay, so you know. Okay, I was wondering what it was. Yeah. DMT. And and in DMT, seven minutes, yeah. I came back, and the first words I said as an atheist at the age of forty-seven, yeah. the first words were, "It's true. There is a God." Yeah, yeah. And I was with my higher self for oh, a yeah. lot of that time. Not God. I'm not saying I was God or, or was in God or whatever. But I knew that I had a higher self, and that was somehow attached to something it's a magnificent. Thing, right? I've done a I've done a bucket load of mushrooms. Once again, uh, okay. that's not going anywhere. Yeah. But um, yeah, it's fascinating, right? It's an well, yeah. interesting realm. Well, I did mushrooms when I was younger and stuff, but it never really prepared me for a DMT. No, it's not the same. You know? no, yeah, and way. so it took me to a point where I realized that we are actually much higher. This body is just an avatar that will serve you while you use, treat it well, and eventually it ages. <laughs> But but, but 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 if, if 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 I say to people if if we've been uh, mistreated if we've been misled then there's a reason for that misleading and it's to do with your soul it's not to do with the money and people being greedy because people, the money people who print the money can have as much money as they want they you know they control us in a Minecraft world where they've left you know everything you do in that Minecraft world has to be paid for you know and everything has to be accounted for and so on and we're moving increasingly into that kind of Chinese socialism or communism I don't know what you want to call it. It got hot on my head. Really? The black, yeah. Yeah, they're not good for you either. Your best really? vitamin D receptors around your eyes. This system does everything it can to poison you, gives you bad information about what the sun is, makes you frightened of the sun, stay out of the sun. I believe that, but I also believe nearly everyone I encounter gives me bad information. I in counseling? Everyone I encounter gives uh, me like, bad information. I wouldn't trust you over anyone else. Mm -hmm. like, trust I, yourself then. That's what I do. So that's what I say to people? Yeah, I run off my own yeah well, what yeah. I say to people is that we use the phrase water level in our language and we can go out and test that in the small and find that water in any body once it's settled will be level and another body near it will be parallel that body of settled water will be parallel to the body below so i'm just being filmed a lot it's not cool i've got to go okay um, i respect you, you go man. well, Don't go well. Me, yeah that's Thank good. You. earth is flat brother it's not a globe we've been lied to about where we live and who we are Dean is taking it to the next level here with a chalking. So we're in. Hi, uh... right, ladies. The Earth is not a globe. It's obviously immeasurably flat, like water. One sea level, all the mountains on earth share the same sea level. Did you know that? Earth is flat, not a globe. We've been lied to. The earth is flat, like the ancients said. You want some information? You know water is always level? The water in your bottle and my bottle will be parallel to each other when they rest, you know that? That's common sense, and your senses won't tell you which way we're spinning. You can't point the direction we're spinning right now, can you? But we're moving a thousand miles an hour. The senses are lied to when you're five years old. You can't live on a ball. You cannot live on the underside of a stone. That's impossible. And the moon, if it was a rock, would fall to the floor. Rocks don't float. Rocks don't float, it's common sense, but you've been brainwashed to believe you can be a monkey and live under a ball. And that water will form under that ball. I need to clear some memory. Huh? Hey. 